Hi everyone and welcome to TWF Impact. I am Michael Cole here with Madison Rain and with Edward Collins. And today on today on and today on Impact, we're going to have the ongoing hangout between Vlad Dracula and the Velveteen Dream. Well, I'll tell you right now, Madison Rain says, I don't know who Velveteen Dream is. He seems to think he's someone who's above others. He seems to think that he's greater than others. But at the end of the day, he hasn't really done anything. Oh, he was a former WWE NXT North New World winner, but that's all he's done. Edward Collins said, I don't think the Velveteen Dream thinks he's greater than anyone else. I think the Velveteen Dream is just someone who is into playing mind games. Mind fucking with others. But I think at the end of the day, the Velveteen Dream is probably a down-to-earth man who does mind games just to throw his foes off. At least that's what I believe. And now we got the Velveteen Dream, Michael Cole says, coming to the ring now. Well, everyone's happy to see the Velveteen Dream again. The Dream's happy to see everyone again. You see, the Dream came to the TWF last week, and on last Impact, if anyone saw that, and I'm talking about the TWF Impact, not the IW Impact, um, then you know I got this hang-up with this bloodsucker by the name of Vlad Dracula. Or Vlad Tepes, or whatever he wants to call himself, or Vlad Drucka. Well, the dream has told him his dream is over, done. I have beat him, but I think on NXT he didn't get that. So on NXT he beat me up after I beat him on Impact. Which at the end of the day, does that make any much sense? Well, so the Dream's been thinking to himself. I was like, Velveteen Dream, why do you have a hang up with a bloodsucker who got dusted by Abraham Van Housing and Buffy Summers? And then it came to me. He wants the Velveteen Dream experience. He wants to become more name known than he already is. So, if you're listening to me, Vlad Dracula, or Vlad Tepes, or whatever you call yourself, I want you, yeah, the Velveteen Dream wants you to come out and face him. Well, here comes Ashley Williams now. You're not Vlad Dracula. No, you're right, I'm not Vlad Dracula. I'm Ashley Williams, you know, from Evil Dead. Anyway, and I am the matchmaker here. So, I understand that you and Vlad Dracula or Vlad Teptis or Vlad the Impaler or Vlad Draca, whatever, he's got more than one name, you have a hang-up with him or he's got a hang-up with you. So the way I look at it, the way that you want to get your hands on Vlad Dracula and Vlad Taptus wants to get his hands on you. So I say here today on Impact, you two are going to wrestle. You two are going to fight. Is that all right with you, Velveteen Dream? Well, the Velveteen Dream says that Ashley Williams, Vlad Dracula's dream will be over when I beat him in this ring. All right. Just to let you know, the fight's on. No, the fight's not on, Vlad Dracula says. The fight's definitely on. You talk about dreams being over. How dare you talk to Gene Oakland and Jim Ross and tell them that my dream is over when your dream's the one that's over. Hey, the dream was talking with Ashley Williams. I was not talking to you, Vlad Dracula. But yeah, I'm glad you're here. 
because me and you are gonna re me and you are gonna have a fight. Me and you are gonna have a match, and it starts about right now, big boy. Well, what's all that right now, big boy shit? I don't know. I don't know, but I do know that I do know the Velveteen Dream is now taken off his headwear. And it's in everything else he's wearing. Deaning. Oh! He's going right after him, Michael Cole says. Velveteen Dream striking Vlad Dracula. Hitting him. Knocking him down here on impact. Like a weakling, Madison Rain says. That's all the Velveteen Dream is. Is a weakling. Where do you get that from, Edward Collins says. Where do you get off calling Velveteen Dream the weakling? When Vlad Dracula is the one that struck him from behind on NXT last week. Yeah, well, I'll tell you why, Madison Rain said. You haven't forgotten how Velveteen Dream struck Vlad Dracula from behind at the end of NXT last week, too, Madison Rain said. Yeah, but Edward Collins said that was after Vlad Dracula struck Velveteen Dream from behind first. Well, you're right. Madison Rain, and you're also right too, Edward Collins, Michael Cole says. Both men have struck each other from behind. Both men have wrestled and fought each other before. And Velveteen Dream knocks Vlad Dracula right out of the ring. The name known of all bloodsuckers is now out of the ring now. And now he has to come up with some new way to get back at him. Well, I'll tell you what Madison Rain said. He outlived Abraham Van Helsing. He outlived Buffy Summers. So I think he'll outlive him. The Fight Lord's track starting to do the track out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, oh, eight, nine. Well, Velveteen Dream's back in by nine, Michael Cole said. What's this, Edward Collins says? Velveteen Dream is going to do what Randy Savage did. You used to do what CM Punk did some time and time. Here it comes. Oh! Velatine Dream is going to have him beat here, Edward Collins says. Velatine Dream's going to beat Bly Dracula. Are you out of your mind? Bly Dracula or Bly Teptis, he is a bloodsucker. No way the Velatine Dream's going to beat him. Well, we'll have to see, Michael Cole says. Elbow from the top, from the top post. One. Two, three. Ding, ding, ding. Here is your winner. The Velveteen Dream. Velveteen Dream has beat Blood Dracula here on impact. So Blood Dracula can say that his dream is now over again, Michael Cole says. Oh, yeah, that's so, that's so unkind to say that. Uh, Madison Rain says to say his dream is over. Michael Cole, how would you like it if someone went around and said, "Oh, your dream was over"? Going around saying Vlad Dracula's dream is over. Madison Rain said, "Well, it is." Edward Collins says the Velveteen Dream beat Vlad Dracula or Vlad Teptis or Vlad the Impaler or Vlad Draca, Dracula or Draca, however you want to say it. He got beat here on impact. His dream's over. That's right, Michael Cole said. The Velveteen Dream beat Vlad Dracula here. So that would mean Vlad Dracula's dream, whatever that dream is, is now over. And they understand that Gene Oakley now is now going to be speaking with the with the Earl, with the blood sucking Earl Vlad Dracula, who is probably not you know. Yes, Michael Cole. Uh, yes, I'm here. And I'm going to be talking with Vlad Dracula. And he does not seem to be a happy. The blood sucking uh, Earl is not happy after he took his loss to Velveteen Dream. Well, Vlad Dracula, your hang up, Lord. Or I should say Earl. Your hang up with Velveteen Dream has not happened, not worked out quite the way you had in mind. It's like this, Gene Oakland. I'll tell you right now, mean Gene Oakland, or Gene Oakland, 
Velveteen Dream thinks that I'm done with him, then he is sadly mistaken. Yes, I am a bloodsucker, and I am one of the most name-known bloodsuckers on the bloodsucker kin tree, and one of the children of Akasha, the mother of all bloodsuckers. And I'll tell you what, you think that I'm bad. And he likes to keep on bringing up how Abraham Van Helsing and Buffy Summers beat me. Well, bring it up all you want, Velveteen Dream. This is not done between us. Me and you are going to wrestle. Me and you are going to fight again. Well, he did say, Dracula, that your dream was over, whatever that dream was. Do you actually stand on that? No. I do not stand on some jerk saying some jerk saying that my dream is over when it's not. If anyone's dream is over, that would be Velveteen Dream. He's the one who's got the dream over, not me. And the last time I'm going to tell you and I'll tell Velveteen Dream, this hang up between me and you, it's not done. Not at all. Now it's all hot in here. Well, Blad Dracula does not seem to be a happy man. After taking his loss to Velveteen Dream, back to you, Michael Cole. Well, thank you, Gene Oakland for talking with Velvete talking with Vlad Dracula here on Impact. And Vlad Dracula took another loss to the Velveteen Dream here. And we'll have to see if this hang up between each other, Michael Cole says, goes on or not. Well I'll tell you one thing Madison Rain says, Velveteen Dream, if he actually believes that his hang up between him and Vlad Dracula is done, then he's got another guest coming. Madison Rain said, well that might be true, Edward Collins said, the bloodsucker, and I am a bloodsucker, but the only unlikeness between me and him is I got a soul and he does not. Uh, this whole thing between Velveteen Dream and Vlad Dracula is not going to be done at all. And I understand that he is back in the ring now and he is not happy. How dare I, how dare I anyone shame me? I'm telling you right now, Velveteen Dream. This is not over between us. It's only beginning. And the way I look at it, it's only beginning. So, you want to make more out of it? Then come on down, you cunt. And we'll see what a man you're made out of. Don't be going around calling folks by bad English curse words. And two, I told you, Blad Dracula, or Blad Tepis, or whatever you want to call yourself, that your dream is over. I beat you two times. If I need to, I can always beat you again. You know, I can always, I can always beat you again. You're gonna, yeah. Well, only next time we fight, I'm gonna win. Well, it looks like it is all the time we have here for a TWF Impact. I'm Michael Cole for Madison Rain and Corey Graves. I mean, pfft. I mean, I'm Michael Cole from Madison Rain and Edward Collins. Hope you liked Impact, and we'll see you tomorrow for NXT.